In 2002, a Nigerian doctor, Dr. Omalo, made a startling discovery in former Hall of Famer star and football legend Mike Webster's brain during an autopsy conducted after his death from heart attack. Mike Webster had an advanced stage brain disease called chronic traumatic encephalopathy. CTE is a gen- degenerative brain disease that leads to symptoms of dementia, depression, aggression, and suicide. What caused this brain disease? As Dr. Omalo looked further into CT and its other victims, he came to one conclusion. The brain disease is the con- consequence of repetitive brain trauma and concussions from football. Dr. Omalu wrote and published a paper with his findings to help the public better understand how playing football could lead to having this brain disease. The NFL's reaction was immediate. They sued Dr. Omalu for publishing his paper and denied all liability or relationship between football and CTE. Over the course of the next decade, the NFL paid out hundreds of millions of dollars to cover up the connections between CTE and football. They did this because they feared that if parents realized how CTE and football were connected, that it would be the end of football because parents would not let their kids play the sport. The NFL took these actions and lied because they wanted to continue to profit off of the football industry.